Hello, this is Mr. Chips, and I'm going to teach you how to solve a fractional equation. Here we have a fractional equation. The denominator has polynomials in it. We have two binomials on the left-hand side and a trinomial on the right-hand side. The first thing we have to do is factor the trinomial. Two numbers that multiply to negative 3 and add to positive 2 are positive 3 and negative 1. Now I want to get rid of my entire denominator. I'll do this by multiplying everything by a common denominator, which is x plus 3 times x minus 1. In the left fraction, 2 over x minus 1, the x minus 1's cancel out, and we're left with 2 times x plus 3. In the middle fraction, the x plus 3's cancel out, and we're left with x times x minus 1. On the right-hand side, everything cancels out, and just the numerator is left. Now we will distribute the 2. We have 2x plus 6 minus x squared minus, oh, made a mistake there, x squared plus x equals 6. And now we will group our like terms. So we have negative x squared plus 3x. Oops, smart board. Yeah, there we go. Three, all it, er, ah, 3x plus 6 equals 6. Now we'll subtract 6 from both sides, and the 6's cancel out. So now we have negative x squared plus 3x equals 0. Oh, smart board! There you go. There we go. Equals 0. We're going to factor out a negative x, yielding negative x times x minus 3, because 3x divided by negative x is negative 3, equals 0. And this means that x is equal to 0 and positive 3. However, back in the beginning of the problem, you'll notice that x can't be 1 or negative 3 because that would give us a denominator of 0. So x cannot equal negative 1. Oh, wait a minute, no. Positive 1 and negative 3. Let's change that really quickly. That's my bad. That's my word. There we go. Yep, positive 1, negative 3. And of course, uh, neither of those are my solution. And there it is. Thank you for watching. I am Mr. Chips.